This tutorial world looks completely normal, right? Wrong. This tutorial world has been invaded by all types of anime, from One Piece to Demon Slayer to Attack on Titan, and even more than that. And I'm going to use these powers to take down the world of Terraria and figure out the lore behind why this is happening. I made my character as close to as an anime character as I could feel. And if you know what anime character this is referencing, let me know in the comments down below. I'm really curious to see if I got close enough for anyone to actually figure out who it's supposed to be. So straight from here, we can see that we have a Zangetsu, which is Bleach. Stand Arrow. Well, I, I took damage. You are the owner of Hierophant Green. There he is. Oh my. Bloody ho. And then essence of legendary weapon i'm assuming this is for shield hero uh, i guess we just go with legendary bow uh, i'm still trying to figure out to use this premiere box oh i right clicked it it gave me sobble's pokeball oh plus 50 hp he gave me oh so he starts give he give me stats allow swimming and water breathing okay that's really cool well let's try to get npcs because i know that's important so i decided to cut down some trees and get some blocks that would be necessary to advance but then i got surprised by something that was very very unexpected this was hilarious oh oh what is going on uh get him sobble and what's his name a hair of green i haven't watched jojo's yet it's on my watch list i'm sorry is that a titan <laughs> oh and now it's stuck see how much damage it does oh it's kind of in it yet. oh okay that's 30 damage it's not that bad oh oh god he got up <laughs> okay well let's see what he drops he's really loud titan essence titan bone and titan muscle from the anime mod <laughs> so this has a lot of stuff that I can't really make as yet, but there are a lot of things to look forward to, so that's great. So I had my first encounter in this anime world. But moving on from that, I got some more blocks and started building a house. So I had a place to live and could start getting some NPCs to move in. And I know it's a very, very ugly house, but I didn't have much to work with. I didn't have too much blocks and I made a very short time. I tried my best. <laughs> その Obviously, some of these mods aren't going to be finished, but there's three different weapons there that all cost 10 dirt and they all seem a little bit broken. <laughs> Probably won't use it or else it'll just be too OP. Why is it dying? Wait, it's not even Sobble. What's killing it? What? What? I have no idea what killed it. I <laughs> Wait, let's see if the slime dies. No. He seems to... Oh, I heard something else die. He seems to be chilling. I don't... Maybe it's a location thing. Maybe when he jumps over here, he dies. Oh. I don't know what's right here, but something is definitely right here that's just instantly killing things. Whatever, man. Let's just go down to the caves. <laughs> oh, I reached level 2. Still says level 1, but... Yes. Anyways, let's see if he sells anything. Ooh. Oh, he so he sells the um, the Titan stuff, so you don't really need to kill them. Interesting. But here we get the devil fruits. I just need five gold. That's pog. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Stop, stop, stop. Ah, ah, stop, 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 stop. I really need spawn. Wait, actually really need this money. There we go. There's the five gold we needed, bro. Well, as someone who's watched every single episode of One Piece and whose Minecraft skin is literally Luffy, I know that this is the Gamu Gamu no Mi. So let's go with that. I don't know if you can change it later on. Probably not. But I guess we'll go with this. Wait, how does that work with Sobble? Oh, well, it's really loud. Okay, I'm turning out in-game sounds. Jeez, it's so... Every, everything... Oh, it's so, so loud. Okay, there we go. Can I do anything else with this? So it says X to something. Guess I don't have that yet in Q. Oh, oh, is Q a grapple? Oh, that's actually pretty sick. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, okay, so I can't swim anymore, even though I have Sobble. But that also means that I cannot die, which means I literally soft lock myself. Um, okay, I need this Titan to kill me because I'm literally soft locked. Thanks, man. I appreciate it, really. Okay, so if we touch water, we're just soft locked now. Oh, I still haven't found a cave, so let's head right. Never mind, we're heading back home. Really just joined. Oh, I have no fall damage anymore. It's actually pretty hype. Yo, look, it's Rayleigh. What, what happened to him? Why does he look like that? 
<laughs> Looks a little weird. What you got? Really? Upgrade. Take down a large monster. Okay, so I'm assuming he means boss. Great. I'm glad I came back for that. Hey, I think I finally found a cave. Damn it. I'm so fucked. Is there really no way for me to get out of this? I don't know what I did, but I no longer have Sobble's effects and I can take damage now. So I expanded the house again because there may be more NPCs that I'm not aware of, which I was right to think because there are some special NPCs. And then I decided to head back down into the cave. We found a ton of ore that we would need and a few ice chests with nothing that good. Then I had to drain a small water pool so I could get this heart crystal or else I would drown and waste time. <laughs> Not ideal. We found some platinum and a spider biome. So we get tons of silk, which is used a lot later on. And then I did a bunch more exploring. Got on a railway and found a granite biome. And a mushroom biome. And many other small things that I won't bore you with because nobody cares. So I headed back home and crafted up all the new items that I can now make because of the trip. And I decided to expand the house even more and make it look a little bit more presentable by using some different blocks and adding a new section to the house. Okay, and here's the house done. I mean, it's not the most amazing thing I've ever done, but to be honest, I'm kind of burnt out of building houses because of my 100 days as a commoner series. That was a great series, and I made a lot of good houses there, and to be honest, I'm not doing that again. I sunk way too many hours into that. <laughs> right now, let's see what we can craft. First of all, I made this Rune of Lust, whatever that means. It's it's equipable what does it do i don't know we can finish our goblin slayer set wait i just made the grooves twice i thought that was the helmet why can't we make the helmet oh my god oh the helmet needs one feather okay but yeah speaking of feathers do i have uh what was it doing do i have a gravitation potion um uh, also it's day five now but i think we're going on to day six let's see gra oh i do have a gravitation potion great well let's do that right now then wish it was a little bit brighter but whatever oh for sky island what is it the heck what is a bird let's just get a feather they get one i don't think so bro can you guys drop a feather please please bro please just give me a feather oh there's one right there we go got a feather there we go an actual house oh shoot great yeah i needed that well let's head back home there we go i do look like goblins though seems there's no set bonus but it's a lot of defense and a lot of melee damage and damage and we can also make a training sword the damage isn't... Actually, it's about as strong as Zangetsu, weirdly enough. I mean, okay, whatever. It says the training sword is a material, though, so let's see. Oh, so if we get Water Bolt, we can create breathing-style vapor. Oh, I want to go to the dungeon now and check and see if there's a Water Bolt. Well, let's go with Zangetsu, because that's the main blade of Bleach, so... This makes sense. Looks pretty sick. Oh, ho, ho. right click shoots that, though. That's sick. Zangetsu got Tetra. I'm never saying that ever again. <laughs> I can't even put- I don't even know how to shout it that loud. I can't- I'm not doing that. No. No, 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 no. no. Okay, if this video gets 25 likes, I'll try doing it with my full force. <laughs> so good luck to you with that. Let's get a demon altar. Luckily, there's a thing right here. There we go. Wait, that's water. Let's not go to the water. We try again. <laughs> To get over there right there we go okay cool uh why can't i make it or where's my crown did i did i really put away the crown there's no way there's no way i did that there's absolutely no way oh my also apparently i can actually make the same thing i've been wearing but as an actual item and also it's nighttime so i guess it's time get that regen let's go where is he there he is okay okay get to get tensho let's use our new rifle and i have to hit it's really hard to hit. It's also really hard to hit things because of my stand. Because he does so much damage and doesn't give him invincibility. So it just kind of does things. I'm currently using Getsu Get Tensho's and Gomu Gomu No at the same time. <laughs> I find that really funny. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay, that kind of hurt. I'll be careful. It seems my rifle is actually piercing, which is actually really good. It deals with all the little eyes. Yeah, we so won this. Easy win. There we go. And I reached level 3, whatever that means. Now we got Demonite, which is hype. And I think we can level up with really now maybe wait i've heard tales of a terrifying monster in the underworld oh so you don't get another upgrade till we beat wall of flesh that's crazy right so now we got demonite now what can we make with demonite not a whole lot and then fight Eater of world next which i don't think Eater of world is gonna be too hard especially since we have a lot of here we would get to get that show and then my rifle as well it's crazy okay so i set up a really horrible little arena here but i'm hoping it's enough and i got some sticky bombs oh god i, I forgot that they stick to platforms Okay, that should be one broken. Oh, meteorite landed. That's hype. Oh, I did it again. Oh my god. <laughs> what am I doing? Oh, day seven. I feel like Eater of Worlds day seven ain't too bad. Okay, two more should be enough. 
Let's get ready for this. There we go. Where's my sawball? There he is. Oh, Getsuga Tensho did a lot of work there. Oh my gosh, Getsuga Tensho. Sheesh. I am just, I knew this would do really good in this fight. Quincy Bo doing pretty good too. Let's do a rifle. Oh, that pierce is so good here. Oh, I have so much good weapons for Ito of Worlds. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Ito of Worlds. You didn't even stand a chance. Not even a chance, bro. Level 4. I still don't even know what mod that's from. Okay. One last little guy to beat up. There we go. That was a really easy fight. Like, extremely easy. Oh, some of the stuff fell in the water, though. <laughs> Alright, that was an easy enough fight. Turn to Demonite. Again, there's not really much I could do with Demonite at the moment. I'm gonna knight my pickaxe, though, which that's pretty good. Well, a meteorite landed, so I'm gonna go look for that. And I also need to find our jungle, because the next boss we need to fight is Queen Bee. Here's the jungle. Wait. Oh, wait, what's up? Oh, no. <laughs> 17 gold, I'm recalling. I'm not about to lose 17 gold. That's crazy. Okay, well, let me check right this time. Oh, okay. Hey, let's check and see if maybe we can find a water bolt. Because I remember one of the crafting recipes had that. Already? Oh, I went down like two feet. It usually takes so much longer. What the heck? Wait, that's really interesting. Your stand level increased to two. So I guess this there's two different leveling systems going on here. And I don't know which one the other one's for, but it's for something. <laughs> And this one at the top here is actually the stand level. So that mystery solved. Oh, I made it to the ocean on this side. So oh, the meteor is definitely on the right. Oh, here it is right after the damn <laughs> skeleton dungeon. Anyways, we have vein miner, so this is going to be really easy. Holy crap. <laughs> Vein Miner really just makes the game easier. I love it. I might as well just try and fight Skeletron, because, you know, we're anime characters. We're really strong right now. So we might as well try and see what happens. I'm not even gonna set up an arena. Oh, I don't know if I... They, ah. Yeah, Queen Tebow isn't as strong as I thought it was, to be honest. It's just good that it passes. It's going really well so far, though. About to get that first hand down. I should just get it down right now. Bro, Luffy is so OP. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> You're a good Luffy is. Holy crap. Check down, please. Thank you. Yo, I'm so happy right now. It's actually insane. There we go. Great, I can tell this is a dungeon now. That's pretty hype. I'm moving so fast. This is some isekai type pacing, bro. Just got dropped into this world and I'm like almost halfway through the entire thing. Literally an isekai. <laughs> oh, day eight and we're in the dungeon. Very hype. Well, I find a mechanic. To be honest, I don't even know if I want to keep her. I, need a, I still need other NPCs. <laughs> I'll just leave her to be <laughs> I really need her. Uh, she might sell something new though. Ah, oh, fine. I still need to expand my houses more. I'm sure there's some more NPCs waiting. Oh, there we go. There's the water bolt. So next we just have to get Queen Bee, because I believe we unlocked something from Queen Bee. So I cleared out the dungeon and headed back home and crafted a ton of new items once again. And I also did a bunch of other boring stuff, but this video is already really long. So I'm not going to waste your time with all that. But as you can see, we have some new jail cells. <laughs> Because <laughs> that's what they are, so I'll call them that. Just think of it like Impel Down. The further down it goes, the less effort there is. It's just coming more and more jail-like. So first of all, we have the Titan Slayer Blade. Which it's, it's, it's just a Titan thing. But along with that, we got ODM Gear. Which as you can see, it's it's just it's just a hook. It's, <laughs> yeah. It's... Next, we have the Colorless Blade. Which is just a normal blade, but the damage is really high. Plus, it's a material. Then, we have Agile Breathing Style Vapor. So right click just stirs out these things. That's really fast. Then left click does is, does the same thing but slightly different. <laughs> they are different. One looks like water bolt, and then one just this is one. Okay, water bolt bounces. Next we have the Jotaro armor set and the set bonus star platinum became faster. Well, we do not have star platinum, but we got tarot cards, which I believe is a way to get stance. I haven't watched JoJo, so don't make fun of me. <laughs> so consumable. So you. How do we can do we... Oh, I used it. Do I have a new stand now? Oh, oh, I have star platinum. Ability time stop. Ability opens after level 40. Now that we have star platinum, I guess the Jotaro set is better because now he's faster. Let's see if we could find something. Well, yeah, that is pretty fast. Is that faster than if we just had nothing? Oh, yeah, that is way faster. Holy. And then finally, we have the hollow mask, which improves speed, defense, and power boost. The captain's robe, which is melee, and the captain's sandals, which is also melee. Set bonus, 30% melee speed slash damage. Wow, that's a lot faster. Not gonna lie, though, the hollow mask looks really ugly. <laughs> like, let's just, yeah, yeah, no, I don't, I don't want to look like that. But it can look like Jotaro, which that looks way better. Why do I look pink? <laughs> oh, it's because of Luffy. 
I'm pissed up in gear second. So I'm holding Kyoma in gear second, wearing a Jotaro outfit with Star Platinum using a Demon Slayer blade while actually wearing hollow armor. <laughs> That's a lot. Another thing I did is I finished the elevator, which took a while, but it is done. So let's just head down here and there's a couple of things we need. We need Hellstone, first of all, which I should have probably checked if we had lava skin potions, but whatever. And then we also need to check for Shadow Chest because I need the Flame Lash for another weapon. Let's test it out. So that does fit- Whoa, what the hell is that? Bro, he, uh, uh, what? Oh wait, these are two different mods. This one is from the anime mod, but this one is from the Demon Slayer mod. What the heck? All right, well, no one wants to see all of this, so maybe I'll do a small little Hellstone mining montage. I died. <laughs> But I decided, so I keep losing all my money and I forget to take it out. So while we have the money, I wanted to buy a new character, a new Pokemon. But I don't know who I would go for. Anyway, let's buy an evolution machine. So we come here, I believe we make EXP Candy S. And now we have Drizzle, 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 Drizzle. I opened all the shadow chests in my world on the hunt for the Flame Lash. But my luck was complete and utter dog shit. And I didn't find anything. You'd swear it was Satan's son with that kind of luck or something. Oh. Well, I guess we're gonna deal with that. It's day 13, and there's not a single flame lash. I, how is that possible? <laughs> deal with this goblin army quick. When I said deal with it quick, I really meant quick. <laughs> Alright, it's done. I need a, a very short amount of time. <laughs> now let's make Nichirin Ore, which the only thing I can make with it right now is the colorless blade, which I already got. Alright, so I made two more sets, the Avdol set and the Joseph set. Avdol set has a set bonus for magic and red, and then the Joseph set doesn't have a set bonus as far as I can tell. And now, I also got Dotrix, which his ability regens HP during daytime and I fall really slowly. Like, really, really slowly. <laughs> and I also wanted to do this. Look at this. There's a Poke box. I have enough gold to get one because I got a lot from selling all that extra stuff. Let's buy a Poke box. We got a Phoebus. And I guess we're fighting a Blood Moon now. <laughs> So in order to get melodic, you need a link cable prism scale and a large candy. Large candies is hard mode stuff, so we can't even do that yet. So basically what I'm saying is Feebas is useless. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a gambling man, so let's do one more. Baltoy. What is his bonus? Ground type nullifies knockback. Psychic type regens mana faster. Okay, that's actually pretty damn good. No knockback is great. Look at Shark Tooth Necklace. I'll put that on. And evolve Baltoy, we need... EXP Candy M, which is made using Palladium Ore. Okay, cool. So now let's just head towards the Queen Bee, because that's our next boss. All right, we got our first cave here. Now we just look for Queen Bee. So I headed down into the jungle, got some life crystals, found some jungle chests. Then I found what we really came down here to find. On day 14, and Durham is throwing a party. <laughs> so let's turn off Star Platinum, because... He's probably gonna activate it. <laughs> Where is the lava? Okay, it's in a really good- This is a big hive. Yeah, I don't have a campfire. So I guess we're just gonna fight it with that one. Should be fine. I don't think it's gonna be too hard. Summon star platinum and let's go. This is gonna be easy. Plus I have the ricochet thing on my sword. Which is just gonna be even more damage. Oh my- Look at its health go down, man. This is gonna be so easy. There's so much ricochets going on. My health doesn't even move. This is- Oh, this is so easy. This truly is an anime protagonist playthrough. <laughs> I am definitely an anime protagonist. Train ticket. Well, that was easy enough. Oh, look, it's a party. It's a party. Boop, 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 party. Oh, we got a witch doctor. That's pretty hype. And there's nothing new with B-Wax. I didn't think there would be, but worth a shot to check. Oh, God, I just found something I shouldn't have found. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it just a picture of <laughs> Nezu good? Is it like, oh my, bro, no, no, an hour of long luscious hair. <laughs> oh man. Oh, Ren Goku came by. Hey yo, what's up, Ren Goku? There's this huge fish that Tengen Uzui once fought and lost against. I think that thing still has one of his swords. What? Is this some manga stuff? I've watched the anime, but <laughs> I've heard about that. Oh, he sells the sword I already make. But we can get the other flame style one. I think it's the same thing. Is it just the same thing? So this one. Oh, that seemed a little bit weaker. And his right click, just a normal thingy. Okay. And then there's just one other thing we can make. This. Lion Sin's Great Axe. 
which that's a lot of damage but its range is really small and there is no right click this is clearly a reference to seven deadly sins i hate building hell bridges it's just so annoying I built a very short one since i'm not just an anime protagonist but technically an isekai anime protagonist in this world so i got a lot of power because of that like come on now everyone knows isekai anime protagonists are just busted op okay i think that's long enough i feel like the main weapon i'm probably going to use is the water style one because fire damage probably is good against wall of flesh but yeah let's just do this there he is yeah wow he's yeah he's dying <laughs> oh no, this is gonna be such an easy fight, man. I almost feel bad. Let's just let's just like pity him a bit and use some rifles and Zangetsu and <laughs> Okay, wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh god. Okay, I'm gonna pity him too much. Let's kill him with the Oh I was I was gonna kill him with the Zangetsu. I, I guess not. I guess not. <laughs> that was anticlimactic. <laughs> So yeah, now we're in hard mode. So make sure to like and subscribe because this is just part one. Part two is going to come out soon. Also, leave a comment letting me know what your favorite anime power I've been using in this series is. Also, don't forget about the like goal I said. So I, I'll, do, I'll do the thing. I, <laughs> I don't know, man. We'll see. On the left here, a 1.4 summoner query series. There were a lot of six summons in there. That was a great playthrough. Or on the right, you can check out my AJZO SMP series, which is my Minecraft series. Doing some sick stuff over there too. So just, just check it out. See if you like it. Alright, goodbye.